Hello, I am Emily Asher, and welcome to Asher Flow. Last time I was playing Somnium Files, same as this time. If I remember entirely correctly, last time we dove into someone's memories and saw that we may or may not be the Somnium Killer. And then we dove into someone else's memories and saw that our boss was somehow there whenever it happened. So I think that it's about time that we hunt down our missing boss and figure out what happened with that. We got some questions to ask. Before I can do that, I need to figure out some setup things. Okay. Okay, that's live, that's live. is not odd. Okay, I have everything set up now, so without further ado, why don't we figure out who or what boss really is. Well, we know what human, but I'm gonna quit talking for a bit and just Go and find boss. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Day four. At this headquarters. Boss's office. Let's go and find them, shan't we? Oh, and I know that you're not currently here, but Shackleford, thank you for the follow. Oh, I clicked off. <laughs> Okay. Things have gotten weird. Hmm. Shelves. Where would boss be hiding things? Honestly? AC vent. Nope. Hmm. Christmas tree? No clues. Hmm. Oh yeah, this key was weird. I got it. I found it. This must be the key to solving the mystery. God damn it, Dave. Good work, Date. Now you only need to find the giant keyhole. Oh god, I hate the puns. Okay, I love the puns, but still. Hmm. Date, it's Maybe time to stop. Something. Like what? appreciate it if you exercised thought before opening your mouth. This clock means it's time to stop. Ah, good grief. What is different? Something about this area just doesn't seem right. Yeah, the public bath, was that there last time? Oh, I guess maybe it was. This office is so bloody covered in everything. And that RC car was there, the pumpkins were there. Tombstone? Boss, hiding something from me. I could beat her over the head with that tombstone. Hmm. Well, she has been wearing a mask the entire time, so mask. Okay, I'm guessing computer then. Iba, can you hack this PC? I will try. Hacking. Hacking. This is hacking noises. Unlocked. Logging in. You know what? Well, it worked. I some video data. Ooh. It was uploaded only a few hours ago. It's going to be a message to us, isn't it?
So Sejima. Uh, that looked like boss. That's uh, concerning. Why? Why? Yeah, that's certainly boss. Boss? Things have gotten, uh, weird. Very weird. So, boss murdered him. <sighs> yes, save. I probably should have ended off here last time. Hello, Graves. My day's actually going really well. How about yours? Doing anything fun today? There's still six mysteries left unsolved. The real culprit, the six in the incident six years ago in Date's past. Huh. The story's branching points are in Soma. Use the flowchart to jump to branching points in a Somnium. It may be hidden somewhere in the dream world. Find a new way forward. Interesting. Ah. Well, hopefully that email comes soon. Unless you'd rather it not come soon. Okay, so I can't go back into this. But it looks like I'm pointing a gun or something. That's weird. Very weird. Hmm. I don't know how this flowchart works. In number 89, Somnium date, which hit... Nah. Hitomi gang shot by Rohan, and then Boss? Why was Boss there? Date confirmed Pewter to ask, uh, confronted Pewter to ask him about Date's... I just cannot read today. Good grief. Pewter told Date about the corpse of So was found with the left eye torn out. It must have been the same killer. Everything that we found out last time. How does this blow... Oh, wait. I need... To hit B to see the flowchart. But I can't go back here until I've messed with the story more, so I guess I have to begin investigation on the day four. Maybe. Proceed. Uh, Graves, are you excited about Prambian Tone Street? This is a serious matter. Where's Boss? Huh? Boss, where is she? I don't know. I haven't seen her since about noon. Damn it. Dante, listen. Something happened while you were in Samyam. Huh? Please stay calm and listen. So Sejima's body was discovered. He was cut into pieces and put inside a vase in his mansion. That can't be. The housekeeper found him and reported it to the police. And one more thing. So was missing his left eye. You mean the Cyclops killer did it? Probably, yes. It does seem very seasonal. What is your next move, Date? We'll deal with So later. Before that, I need to talk to Boss. I suggest checking her office. Good idea. Yeah, if I am not, eh. if I am still playing this around that time, I'll probably go through and lurk in their stream. Just to watch them react. Where is she? What the hell is going on? What is going on? 
I gotta agree with Dante. What is going on? Shot by Rohan Kumakura. And she's alive. Ima. We've seen her. Boss. Why was Boss there? Because it was a dream? Was it completely random? No, that can't be. You can't dream of a face you've never seen. Number 89 must know Boss somehow. Okay, so I'm back here looking for a clue again. Hmm. That is odd. Iba, can you hack this PC? Uh, Open it. So Sejima. <laughs> so boss killed So Sejima. And I'm right back to where I kind of started with this. How does this work? Oh, I get it. I haven't gone through the right process. So I need to unlock the other branches. So I think that I need to begin sync here. Don't know what I can do differently, though. Sup? No, not sup. Why are you sleeping on the job? Sup? Because I want to, obviously. Why are you getting mad at me? Yeah, this rug feels so good on my skin, yeah? Why are you suddenly a cat? Playtime's over. Let's begin. And stand up. Is this the Sagan residence? It definitely is. But why? Number 89. What were you up to? So I should be inside number 89 Somnium right now. What? The green? I do not think I can pass through it. Really wants to hide it, huh? Somnium skin! I think I've hit the point of the game where I'm just going to be confused. This appears to correspond to the green thing. So I never messed with the switch before. Maybe that's a something. Switch? But there are thorns around it. Mm hmm. Flip the switch. This switch again. Last time we handled it in a different manner. That was then. This is now. But there are thorns. You are aware that I am the one who feels the pain. It's fine. It'll only hurt for a bit, then it'll be better. Oh, it doesn't hurt. Oh. That is a much different thing than last time. A phone. Should I pick it up? I wonder, if it's different than before, maybe I should treat it differently. So, hang up this time. What the- Nope. It still hates me hanging up. Weird. Okay, ignore it this time. Same as last time. I guess. 
So, is there a branching path on this one? There's the book, Liquid. Let's see. A winter iris that I know. Last time, whenever I picked it, it worked. What's going to happen whenever I do that this time? Can I make it through without ripping up any of the books? You can do it. I believe in you. Stop it! You're distracting me! I got one! Aw, right after I pulled it out, too. Weird. Did the green stuff react at all? Okay. Now let's check the a picture. picture. Just a picture. It's worth a thousand words. Let's fill it out with our blood. I don't have a pen. No choice. I must use my blood. You yep, hearing problems, bad we're far. right back here. I got the ability to go on branching timelines, and I can't see anything more about Boss oh, until okay. then. The hey, one thing that Iva? I believe you missed was we blood, saw Boss but it is kill not the so. Same as human blood. No need to worry. And besides, we are in a dream. Still, blood? I'd feel better if you used a different word. For example? Body fluids? I'm gonna skip through this, cause... Okay. Hey, Dante, you've got four minutes. So, I'm going to ignore it again. One thing I'm trying to do right now that's different than last time is I'm trying to get through without ripping up a book. Well, at least you didn't faint. Hmm. Where is the floor lamp, I wonder? Because that's a new thing that I didn't interact with last time. Okay, it's... Is it just me or is everything... Far more sepia tone than last time. It seems very blurry. Actually, that could be because the lamp's on. Okay. There's probably no way to turn it off. Grab it. Are you sure? No, but it's a pull. Grab yeah, it. Go ahead. Is this okay? Yeah, it did something. Uh, okay's relative. Looks okay. Huh. So that did make some progress forward. Hmm. I'll mess with the liquid. There is some kind I should be able to stick my hand into it and pull that plug again. Hmm? It is surprisingly deep. Obviously not green tea. Perhaps it's jelly. Weird jelly. It's not jelly. Okay. So I need something else that I can do. Oh. Oh yeah, the ceiling fan. That'll do. Told you last time that I would never notice the ceiling fan. Is that like a giant desk fan? A desk fan only moves the air immediately around it, whereas a ceiling fan circulates air in an entire room. It's really weird to me that he doesn't know what a ceiling fan is. Oh, right. Okay, so... Blow on it. Blow on it? Yes, blow on it. Blowing on it stopped it. You have three minutes, Dante. What is that?! Eye. 
Sate, what are we going to do? That eyeball's really weird. So I'm gonna close the curtain on the eyeball. Yeah, I didn't want to spend the time yet for the bucket. I will do the bucket if I need to do something. It left. That eye. Do you know something about it? Yes. It was kind of cute. Dante's you got weird. Are... Insane. Everything. If he wasn't so hot, I would judge him. What? That's... Hitomi? Okay, this time I'm not going to go through and spend all this time on Hitomi, and... Why is everything so insanely sepia tone? A skull. I do not see the body. Quite frankly, if I couldn't see the rest of my screen, I'd think my screen was breaking with this. Hearing you're a better person than I am. Let's see, I think that last time I had to chuck it out the window or something. Would that not be disrespectful to the dead? Dead? It's a hunk of calcium. Alright. Sorry about this. <laughs> Whose skull was this? Unknown. I also cannot determine the connection to number 89. Okay. What else do I have access to? Hmm. So, book, 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 pot, Hitomi. Okay, let's go and do something with the pot. Hey, pot. It's a pot. Steam is rising from it. It appears to be some kind of green curry. Maybe a soybean stew? It might also be boiled green juice. You're yeah, all like wrong. A it's a hat. A turtle ninja could leap out at any moment. Oh, damn. I have to use the double. Oh, well. Wear it. What? I told you to wear it. Wear it? Alright. Here I go. Yeah, Hitomi's a weird character. Their reaction to their daughter being dead uh, is, okay? uh... I am fine, actually. It wasn't the same In as the fact, other ones. I feel as though my defense has risen. I'm a little worried about your head. Why? My head is thoroughly protected. Am I the only one that wants to grab a wooden spoon and just start dinging? Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> Okay. So, I just have a bunch of books and her. Ah, great. I don't want to rip up the books. Actually, what happens if I just read the books? Read it. The smile and kind words of a woman nurtured Falco's withered heart back to health. Sounds like you, Date. No, not at all. Really? The nourishment is temporary. Then I go and check my wallet and hits me. Oh, Oof. I see. You are talking about that cabaret girl again. Stop! Don't remind me. Okay. How about this book? A book. I'll use the one fourth time and read it. Falco was in a bind and turned to a trusted friend. The rest is marked over. But I want to know what happened after. Hmm. Less than one minute. Hurry. Understood. A book. One fourth. Read it. F stands against evildoers and brings them harsh justice. 
guy sounds like Judge Dredd. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Bad yes. thing. Gotta agree, Dante. Let's see. That's those books. Here's this book. book. an assassin for the Kumakuras. Rohan himself bestowed F a code name. That name is Falco. Falco. Oh. Okay, I think this is going to be the last book. Unless I missed something. I'd really not rip them up. F does not have parents or siblings. He was raised in an orphanage. F. Or Falco? And I have made no progress. Ah. Prevent the invasion of question. The only thing left that I can do is this. It's Hitomi. Uh, I don't know. Because last time this didn't push me forward at all. So, Hugger. Well, I suppose I will try it. She's hard. Yeah, me too. Hmm? God damn it, Dante. Sorry, nothing. It's Hitomi. Okay. Talk to her. Understood. Hey! Hitomi! Hitomi! No use. Could you try it again, but more in a fawning way? I believe we should try but Morning. Let it go. Dante, I both feel you and you're also creepy. It's Hitomi. Where? Uh, well, uh, maybe her. Dante, this is where you're single. Her stomach, right? Yeah. It's not like I'm touching her. She's extremely hard. Perhaps due to her being stationary? What did you say? That she is stationary? No, before that. She's hard? Hitomi is hard right now? Got it. That's useful information. Let's keep that in mind. God, what's Hitomi's condition right now? Could you stop messing around? Or would you like me to crush you with this vice? Hey, relax, I was kidding! Uh, Dante! 30 seconds! It's Hitomi. Last what? one. Kiss her. Other you? than this, I'm guessing... There's just one way through this. Like You are like one of my limbs, Iva. Yes. Like an alter ego. An incarnation of me to kiss Hitomi. Yes. Then it's like me kissing Hitomi, right? No. God damn it, Date. You sure? Because that was making my heart rate rise. And another Could it just be only your heart, please? Okay. So there's only one way through here. Apparently. So I'm gonna go back to the flowchart and find another one to go into, I guess. Oh, wait. This. Ah, that's how it works. So I went to the wrong thing. Unfortunate. So I'm gonna jump into this instead.
I don't... I'm gonna admit, I don't remember exactly what I did last time that was different than what I need to do this what time. What is this place? It looks depressing. How is this related to Iris? Unknown, but there must be a connection. Iris, what are you hiding? So the first thing that I did was turn the TV tuner. Somnium scan! Activate! To lock number two is the windows. So I'm thinking that that's where I need to start. Okay. Oh wait, the two branching paths are both. Watch them murder and look for blood. Interesting. So what's on the map? I've got TV and I've got doors. The doors are the only other thing and they're behind me. A double door. Okay. Open it. Nothing doing. It doesn't open. We don't have to worry about it. Eh, I am somewhat worried. Guess I know how tight Time is door. this round. Tackle it. Hiya! <laughs> Hiya! Stop that! You're not helping. A doubled. Okay, so nothing with the double door. So it must be to do with the TV then. A CRT TV. So this time. Spinning the dial gives me one thing. I'm guessing hitting it gives me another. Fixing it by hitting it is an old-fashioned approach. A very well, effective old-fashioned old approach. Object, so... Oh, that is different. What the fuck? That's weird. What was that just now? A child's drawing of a rat. Iris must have drawn it. It is not yet possible to determine that. Let's continue the investigation. There is much to interact with. Is everything gonna be sepia tone? Hit the mouse. Okay, mentor lock number two. What is there to interact with? I've got doors, medical shelf, gun, and mirror. I'm guessing from last time the mirror is still going to be exactly how it was, but the gun looked to be different. Medical shelf probably has the explosive on it still, the um, nitroglycerin, because that's actually used for heart conditions, I believe. Or maybe it's a different nitroglycerin. Okay. Gun, mirror, doors aren't interesting, so I will see about the gun, I believe. A revolver. Is it real? It appears that way. It's a real revolver. Never look down the barrel of a revolver shoot it I do not see any bullets inside I didn't Just say if there were bullets all right I'll give it a shot I don't like this angle as I thought this will not work we need a bullet hmm. five minutes left Dante if we need a bullet, maybe something on medical shelf I see many is objects needed. In the room.
I'll use my 20 seconds and investigate the TV. It appears to be a frog. A child's painting. Let's hope it's not dangerous, or you might croak. Was that supposed to be funny? That one no, just hurt, Dante. I was Dante. Just thinking about the meaning of the painting. That just hurt. There does not appear to be a particular meaning. I agree. Okay. A shelf. Various things have been placed on it. So let's use the half and mm, smell it. There is a sweet smell, like syrup or I knew it, nitroglycerin's on it. It's either a sweetener or possibly nitroglycerin. Be careful. Because nitroglycerin explodes even from slight impacts, it is usually mixed with acetone to lower the sensitivity. Acetone, huh? I did not expect Iris to be aware of how to handle such dangerous chemicals. I'm guessing that that's everything that we needed to know from that shelf, possibly. Let's see. So, doors aren't interesting. Mirrors, all that's left that's interesting to me. Possibly. A full body mirror. Oh, it is different than last time. Hmm. Let's use the 20 seconds and talk to this mirror. Iba, what are you doing in a place like this? Being caught. I'm taking care of Date. He's so troublesome. Oh, I understand. He can't do anything without you, can he? Yeah. Cut it out. <laughs> uh, well worth it. Four minutes. A full body. Okay, one fourth time. Punch it. Are you sure I can break this mirror? You can break no, this mirror. I don't think you have the strength to break it. I believe in then you. Then why did you ask me to, pervert? Just punch it and How does that make a him a pervert? You see? It won't break. What was the point of that? Is the mirror just nothing? I'll try the last thing. Half look at it. I see my reflection. Really? What could this mean? Your reflection should be the figure I'm thinking of. So, what is your true form? Whatever you imagine. My appearance is nothing but a vessel. So, your spirit is your true form. A full huh. body. That was a very surprisingly accurate thing. I agree hearing that was a very good punch. A shelf. Various things have been placed on it. Okay. Is it worth using the 30 second on this? I don't think it is. So let's just investigate. Well, there goes What? Oh shit. The explosions appear to have stopped. The explosions made the room change. Well, I figured out what this to do. Is a dangerous dream, but we must continue. Oh, blew up the frog. Ah. Three minutes, Dante. Okay, what's on the map this time? I've got the reference book, which I used last time by ripping it up. I've got an operating table. And I've got another TV. What's my goal? Tear and stab it. Hmm. I'm guessing tear refers to this book. It appears to be a butterfly reference book with pictures! Let's see... Use one sixth time and rip it. Rip and that tear. That will be difficult with it being this thick. Eh, ripping books in half isn't that hard if you know what you're doing. 
It actually is just technique. Okay, that's... Butterfly effect. I suppose that is somewhat accurate. The more you do, the less time you have. But we have no choice but to investigate further. Right. Okay, next to stab it, what do I have access to? I have the locker, operating table, gun, TV, and gas caster. I'm guessing I need to stab someone on the operating table. So, over here. Operating An table. Operating table. But I can't stab with it. So apparently that's not the right thing. Gun, mirror, doors, locker. Oh, locker, that releases it. That's what I need to do, probably. Just a locker. Just a locker. Open it, but be fucking careful when you do. That was close. If this were the Delta Princess, I would have been stabbed. Why was it booby trapped? I do not see anything else inside. Would you like me to examine the knife? Good idea. Okay. Where'd the knife go? This time it didn't hit the gas canister. The knife that flew out of the locker. Seppuku, push in, or throw it. Wait, Seppuku? My mind completely glossed over that. But knowing this game, it says to stab something. This, uh, isn't going to be fun. Surely she's not going to go through with it, but... Maybe? I don't know. Do you wish for me to die? For no, you not I to. Not. But why must I commit seppuku? In this foreign land, I believed it to be the only course of action. I Bad course of action. refuse. Good course Do of action. Do you wish to speak a haiku in your final breath? Your samurai impression is ridiculous and inaccurate. Stop that! Is this Somni I'm starting to get to you, Date? Yes. I'm my usual self. That's the problem. But in any case, I will not do it. Good. Okay, so that wasn't the right answer. The knife that Honestly, I'm locker. thankful. Okay, so let's, uh... Push in. That's not usually how you push in a knife. In any further. She literally You're punched less than it. Two minutes, Date. Hurry. The knife that flew out of the locker. Okay. Can you throw it? Like Oh, this? you can. What? I only threw it lightly. Lightly, she says. As a hell of light throw. An oil drum, television, and torso. Weird. I think I understand. I'm starting to see the picture. You are? I do not yet understand it. Uh, shoot and kill. But to shoot, I need to have a uh, bullet for the gun. So, hmm. TV, torso. I'm guessing that the torso is what I'm going to shoot. But it also looks beat up, so maybe it will have something for me. Now the question, where is it actually? There it is. A naked. Nah, nothing useful there for me just yet. I don't think. An oil drum. 
Okay, uh, look inside of it. I swear if you tell me that there's a lid. Do not jump scare me. What does this mean? Bullet! Yay, what? it's what I needed. Maybe you can use them in that. Hello, game. vacant school. How are you today? Okay. So I got the bullets. And I have a, a gun. Let's go ahead and use one six time and remove the gun. Oh wait, the TV's there, I can just load the bullets probably. The and cannot move. Can you loosen it? Impossible. Is there some kind of meaning to it? Ah, what kind of phone did you get, Vacant? I actually pretty recently got a new phone myself. I got the Moto Ace 5G. Ooh, Z, Z Fold 3 is very nice. A revolver. I was one worried about the folding screen ones. Not necessarily for the folding screen itself, that's actually fairly good tech, but for the other pieces of it, since it's not that popular of a phone, how easy they will be to get. I'm sure that the folding screen's completely covered under warranty, but like the screen on the outside. Let's shoot it. That seems like the appropriate course of action. Can we use the bullets we found earlier? This could work. I'll try shooting it. Oh god, it's a cat. I am sorry, Yoshibi. The cat is dead. Oh. That is actually really gruesome. What am I saying? Last time I watched two kids get murdered. First Tome has to watch me ripping up books. But this is weird. He wasn't here last time. Earring, I gotta agree, the foldable phones do look awesome. I don't think I'd be able to keep myself from just flipping it back and forth constantly. I got a zip up lighter and never put fuel on it just because I wanted to flip it back and forth. What happened during that Somnium? We saw the whole thing on the monitor. But we're just as confused as you are. Well, upon further reflection, it is not so strange. Dreams yeah, my first phone was a knockoff Nokia. When you sink into Somnium, there is no guarantee of what you will discover. What about the figure? Could have been Iris herself. That is a possibility. The sinker sees the subject's dream from the third person. That means that Iris... She must have met So Sejima somewhere. We did see Congressman Sejima in there. We saw that shadow kiss him, too. Did that happen in reality? Not necessarily. I'm sure you've had dreams of kissing celebrities and porn stars, right? I don't the think I've ever was, dreamed of kissing part... anyone. No. You sure about that? Anyway, you know what I mean. 
A dream is not made up entirely of memories. It can include things outside of your memory, like TV or movies. TV and movies are both in Even your memory. If the figure was supposed to be Iris. Her smooch insomnium does not necessarily reflect her actions in reality. You can't use the word smooch. Why not? So we don't know if Iris and So are acquainted. That's right, because So is a celebrity of sorts. It's possible she just saw him on TV or online. I guess technically my first phone was a rotary phone, but my first cell phone was a knockoff track phone flip phone. It worked, but it was also terrible. I think my second was a track phone knockoff razor. My third was a phone with a slide out keyboard, also on track phone. And my fourth was the Moto G1, then I got the Moto G5 Plus, and now I have the Moto Ace. Date, Iris is about to wake up. Got it. I kind of missed the Moto Racer. You cops are more rough than I thought. You signed a Earth consent right. form before you came in here, didn't you? Why the fuck would you do that? You forced me to sign it. Anyway, Iris, I have some things I want to ask you. What? Do not consent to being asked things by the police. It doesn't end well for you. Now, well, let's see. How are you feeling? Do you remember your dream earlier? She's not going to. Do you know a politician named Sejima? He's about to be cut up into little pieces and shoved into a vase. By my boss. Yeah, I know his name and face. I've never met him. You haven't? I'm just an internet idol. It's not like I have connections to politicians or anything. She's got a point. About the Nile message with Ota. I actually forgot about that. Iris, let me ask one thing. The message Ota sent you on Nile. I won't tell anyone about that thing. What is that thing? I don't know. Ota's the one who wrote that. You should ask him. I'll ask him politely Ota's not to tase so me this time. But he definitely sent that Nile message. Ota purchased a new phone in Akihabara yesterday. How the Same hell's number? he gained the money? Yes. Call it. Connected. Hey. It's Kaname Date. Where are you? Ota, I know you can hear me. At home. I'm at home. Got it. Wait right there. I'm coming over. Is Tessa still at the police station? Yes. If you want me to talk, release her. Hell no. Criminal procedure law number 198. Persons may refuse to heed a summons or leave the supervision of the police at any time unless they are arrested or detained. Tessa isn't a suspect. According to Article 223, this applies to all persons of interest. You haven't issued an arrest warrant for Tessa, right? So if you don't release her right now, you are violating the law. <sighs> Damn. Just you tell Tessa what the fuck he did. You want my testimony, right? Bring Tessa here, and I promise I'll tell you everything I know. I'm gonna tase that fucking kid. This kid is starting to get on my nerves. And by taste, so, I mean kick in the face. Shit. Uh, oh, that's why. Ah, <laughs> uh, nah, dropkick would leave me vulnerable on the ground. Someone's gonna drop, but it's gonna be that kid. 
Hmm. I don't want to head to the diner because he's still going to tase me. Unless his mom's there. In which case, I don't think he would get the opportunity. Hmm. How are you feeling? I'm okay. Normal, I guess. Why? Did you do something that would make me sick? Yes. Just took a peek inside your head is all. Inside my head? Good point. I doubt that I would get up from a drop kick from just about anyone. Much less someone twice my size. Let's see, do you remember the dream earlier? Dream? What are you talking about? The subject of the sink does not experience Somnium as you do. Iris would not know about it. Oh yeah, but if Dante dropkicked him, you'd mess up his nice coat that he's apparently had for this entire time. Okay, let's head over to the diner. Iris, come with me. We're going to Matsushita Diner. Were We're you get talking to Ota? Yeah, telepathically. I have special powers. Anyway, let's go. He's only half lying. I swear to God, kid, if you tase me, Tessa, I'm going to beat the ever-living shit Oda. out of you before it's you can be cut you. in half. That's right. It's not like you can do whatever you want just because you're the police. Maybe not, but you better keep your promise. Oda, where's your mom? I'd feel a lot safer if your mom was here, or your dad. Actually, screw that. I don't want to see your dad. Yeah, being cut in half might be the... Oh, wait, I forgot. He was stabbed, then cut in half. Never mind, that's probably worse. Okay, I guess you bought a new cell phone. Did I keep you waiting? Where's your mother? About that thing in the Nile message. I get the feeling that I've... If I ask about that thing, he's going to tase me again. So, uh, where's okay. your mom? She's in the living room in the back. Get her out here. I think here. she's watching TV or something. Okay. Did you come all the way here just to ask me that? No, I came over all the way here to get tased again. Did I keep you waiting, silly boy? I was nervous thinking about Tessa. I couldn't stop imagining what dirty, perverted dojin plots you were acting out with her. As long as I am in your eye socket, that won't happen. Wouldn't happen anyway. Yes, you bought a new phone. Yeah, I did. Yesterday in Akihabara. Oh god, I'm gonna get tased again, aren't I? Well... Here we go. So let's hear it. What is that thing? That thing? Don't play dumb. You sent that message to Iris. Oh, um... Date, will you do me a favor? No. What? There's a picture on the counter, right? Yeah, and? I want you to take a good look at it. The I photo. will fucking yes, kick you through the, the window. Photo. Child or not, you're about to get fucked up. Okay, you dumbass. Oh god, he hit me with a fucking frying pan this time. Oh wait, that is the difference. He didn't knock out my camera. Zooming along. Speed of sound. Uh, 
head is pounding. What time is it? The day has turned over. It is Monday, 2.50 a.m. You've been unconscious for nearly five hours. Okay, I know that the AI can drive my car. I've known that the entire time. But how the fuck did I get in the car? That's my only question. Wait, hearing problem. What about what that earlier? That one I don't get. Ota got me, didn't he? He did. He struck you over the head with the walk. Ah, <sighs> little bastard. Why did he do that? I don't know. But afterward, he ran off with Iris. How do you know? You had lost consciousness, but I was still watching. I wonder if I she can refuel the, the car. Take a look. Okay. Something happen? I. No, everything's fine. I thought that she was gonna shoot okay, the mom. Let's go. So I'm guessing she put me in the car. Why didn't you chase them? I'm sorry. You should have jumped out of my eye and ran after them. I couldn't move. Wait, the why couldn't you move? The controlling my ambulatory motion were short-circuited by the blow to your head. Oh. <sighs> Date, the boss They're being called. killed again, aren't they? Oh, how am I gonna report this one? But this time, I'm gonna Date, fucking listen. stop it. Stay calm, but this is an emergency. Just now, the killer... Just watch the video. I oh, that's interesting. She knows actually live. I Unexpected. But I'd rather keep watch playing this. <laughs> No, that's... The criminal is streaming this live. Iva, the source. Identify. The Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse, Koto District. Let's get the fuck Okiura. over there. Date, we focus. got it this time. We need to get to the site, now. Time to get zooming. Please don't be a repeat of last time. Please not the exact same thing as last time. Sick bastard! I didn't think about it, but he didn't livestream the kid's death last time. Well, I assume he... I have no idea. Hold on! I'll save you! Hota! I still think the Hota's involved in this somehow. Stay away from Tessa! 
it just matches him too well. Date, we've almost reached the destination. Please, please let me make it in time. Fingers crossed. Come on, baby. Oh? Well, he has a stab wound, but he's not you okay? dead. She isn't dead either, I don't think. Date. Where did they go? Through the back door. Just hang on, Ota. Help is on the way. Oh, Tessa's alive too. Don't worry. Iris is alive. Oh yeah, Iris. Backup is en route to this location. Date, pursue the culprit. Alright, I'm on it. I wonder if she'll get the same type of eye that I have. Any traces of the culprit? Oh, Still damn. nothing. We also didn't catch the culprit on any of the surveillance cameras. They probably got away through the back alley. While wearing a polar bear costume. Maybe they took it off and threw it in the ocean. If it were filled with something heavy, it would sink to the bottom. That's unfortunate. What's on your computer? Anything? I can't check it. No, of course I can't. Well, boss. About the fishery, about Iris and Oda, about CSI finding nothing, about Soju. Eh, how are the kids doing? They were taken to Central Hospital. Oda's surgery went well. He's in treatment now. He's oh, that's stable, good. nothing life-threatening. Iris, though. Is she still in surgery? Yeah. Iris's left eye was forcibly removed. Because the optic nerve is connected to the brain, the surgery will take some time to complete. Oh god, so they ripped out a piece of her brain. Ouch. Okay. Have you contacted their parents? Of course. Hitomi's at the hospital, waiting for the surgery to finish. And Mayumi? She was at the hospital earlier, waiting for Ota to get out. I think she went back home to get some clothes and things for Ota's hospital stay. Date, last night, Mayumi left the diner to chase after Iris and Ota. Perhaps she knows something. Yeah, she might. I doubt she knows Let's anything. Let's listen to Mayumi's story. Okay. Has CSI found anything at the warehouse? I doubt it. It's still ongoing, but they haven't found anything of note yet. Date, Aiba, go to the warehouse again and investigate. You two might be able to find some useful clues. Maybe. Because he didn't get the chance to clean up after himself la like last time. About the fishery that isn't actually useful. You should ask Iva about that. Yes, I have already done some research. Okiara Fishery is owned by the Okiara we know. Renju's father created the company. Another connection to Renju. No, actually. Currently, Okiara Fishery has nothing to do with Renju. The company has been managed by office representatives for the past 17 years after Renju's father died. Renju holds no shares and is not involved in the management. In short, 
Renju did not inherit the company from his father, and it was- So it's a coincidence the criminal chose that location? No, oh, I no. hardly doubt that. Oh, that's a good question. Can we hear about to represent you from them? They're giving statements at HQ right now. The line is pretty long. You Damn. could just talk to Mizuki. Right. She's part of the Okiura family, too. Oh, speaking of... I forgot hey, who boss, she is. Did you end up sending anyone to take care of Mizuki yesterday? Jeez, you're finally getting around to asking that? Oh. Yes, she's fine. I shouldn't have forgotten that I had who one of our was. new recruits take her. She took her back to your house, so Mizuki should still be there. So and this time, her friends aren't all dead. And I'm fairly certain she's furious with you. Eh, it could be After worse. After leaving her alone with Mama, I mean. Okay, about so. So, Sejima? He was in Iris' Somnium yesterday. Right. But Iris says she's never met him. Why not ask So about it? So lives in Azabu, right? I, I doubt guess it I could. picked up on my microphone, but my elbows just popped. Ow. Alright, boss. I'm going to investigate all this. Got it. We're counting on you. Let's go, Iva. Roger that. Let's see. <sighs> Mess. Okay, we can go to cold storage. We can go to the diner. We can go and see So, who isn't chopped up into little bits right now. We can go to Central Hospital. Or we can go home. You know what? I'm going to start off by going home. See our new daughter. Well, old daughter, but still. I always forget to hit hey, Mizuki, a, that's why those take are a break? so long. I want to ask you something. How the fuck? No, I want to know about... <clears throat> I want to know about this. How the hell is this little girl stronger than me? Good god. Child. You should not be doing this. Where's the officer that dropped you off? Did they just leave you alone? They should've. Okay, uh, about Dota and Iris. They're not dead. Okay, about the fishery. It smelled weird. You're mad at me, aren't you? Oh, I can apologize. Do it. Listen, I get it. I'm really sorry, Mizuki. Yesterday, I went to meet up with the Yakuza gang. The Kumakuras. Remember Mama said Renju had some connection with them? So I went to question them. But of course, I couldn't take a little girl with me. You understand, right? There was a shootout. I'm not shoot afraid you would have gotten shot. In three seconds. Girls should Three seconds like is that. too long. That's awfully sexist of you. This is why no one thinks you're attractive. No, I'm it's attractive. not sexist. It's uh -huh, the fact that you're young. That. That's why you haven't had a girlfriend in four years. My girlfriend is a ninja. You know, she's just hiding in the shadows. Sure. So what My do you want to ask me? My girlfriend is. Hmm. Let's see. What happened to the officer that dropped you off? Did you kill him? Is he okay? Where's the officer who dropped you off? I told her to go home. I said I would call her to check in. Okay. Why are you disappointed? Did you want to meet her? It's not like that. Honestly, meeting her, her sounds nice. Seeing her boobs, not so much. Boobs, pervert. I like big boobs too. 
I suppose you are what they call a tit man. Titlating. Oh god, this is such a weird thing. Okay, about our Sonoda. I saw the video. The one at 3 a.m. last night. Ota is amazing. I'm changing you my sure mind about, about that, that guy. Ota's out of intensive care. Iris is still... But I know she'll be okay. Iris' surgery will definitely be a success. You stay positive, even if there's no reason to be. It's one of your good qualities, Date. What? I believe it. Iris is going to be just fine. Maybe. How about the fishery? You know anything? Okira Fishery is a company Grandpa made. I don't think Daddy had anything to do with it, though. Grandpa died 17 years ago. Someone else is running that company now. They aren't family. What kind of person was your grandpa? I never met I him. I never met him. He died before I was born. But Daddy did tell me stories. What Ooh, kind of stories? Stories. Back when Grandpa was in Great Grandma's tummy, she was on a passenger ship that got shipwrecked in a storm. She had to have the baby out on the ocean. Damn. The ocean. Yup. And then Grandpa was raised by dolphins. Huh? By Weird. the time he was ten, he was catching fish with his bare hands. And then Grandpa got up on land and learned language and culture and stuff. And then he decided to start up Okiura Fishery. Sounds like a tall tale. Yeah, yeah. Grandpa was a legend. All the fishermen <laughs> and sailors respected him. I feel like it makes her really happy to talk about him. But that can't be true. But there's part of me that's thinking, maybe. After all, Mizuki herself herself is superhuman. I believe her grandpa was a incredible man. Honestly, same. I'm gonna leave you here Thanks and for talking go and me, check out other things. It was helpful. Was it? I have to continue the investigation, so... Wait, you're leaving me again? I'm coming with you! No. Why? I can't involve you. This might be dangerous. It's okay, I'm strong. You know how strong I am, right? You were the one who knew how special I was before anyone. Hey, what happened? Who did this to you? Some kids at school? Five or six of them. They said I was a weirdo because I don't live with my mom and daddy. And they teased me. And I got mad and... I told them to go away and they hit me. Oh. Tell me their names. I'll teach the little punks a lesson. Date, wait. Adult intervention will not solve this problem. Mizuki has to deal with this problem herself. Mizuki, come on. It's time to train. What? I'm gonna teach you how to kick their asses. We're starting right now. Get ready. Why the shrine? A shrine is the perfect place for special training. It is? You feel better when you train in quiet, serene places like this. Sure, whatever. First, I am going to teach you four secrets to becoming stronger. Follow these four rules, and you will acquire power beyond your wildest dreams. Date, are you playing a character or something? I'm not Date. While we're in training, I am master. This is a very interesting place. Guard dog lanterns. 
Oh wait, can't I see where I am? Monument. What does it say? When riding an elevator, mashing the door close button doesn't actually do anything. That's what, what it says. Fuck? You're lying. Aren't you? Obviously. <laughs> what is this? Hey Date, what's that? It's a Chozuya. This is where you wash your belly button in the sacred water before you visit the shrine. Belly button? Yes, absolutely. In Shinto, the belly button is said to be the dirtiest place. That is why, before praying, you have to cleanse yourself. I see. My belly is holy. I didn't mean for that to rhyme. Did it? I don't think that that did rhyme. Hmm. Anything on this side? Nope. And okay, again, let's talk to you. So, apprentice. The key to victory is to kill the heart. Being quick to act is crucial. Your everyday life is of dire importance. Mental preparation is important. Yeah, your everyday life is of dire importance. What? Why? The best training you could ever have is to be mindful during your everyday life. That is Diet and exercise true. form a strong body. And if you are always maturing intellectually and emotionally, you will always be able to anticipate your enemy's first move. Or just don't get yourself into get stupid it. situations. But you're so messy! Does that mean you can't fight? Hark. The blowing of the wind through the trees. You can't just say something cool to avoid my question. Smart. Okay, mental preparation's also important. In a fight, you must first be victorious in your mind. Like thinking I'm not gonna lose? Exactly. I do the same mental preparation before going to a strip club. What the fuck, Dante? Before I go in, if I tell myself that they're all out of my league, then they will be. The mental fight has begun the moment I put my hand on the door. Yeah, I see. Actually, no. That's stupid. Dante's should not be apparent. Just no. Key to victory is to kill the heart. I feel like she's going to stab me in the heart if I do that. So, uh, being quick to act. Mizuki, sure. do you know how to win any fight against any opponent? Um, don't get in a fight in the first place? True. That is a respectable answer. But no, the way to win any fight is this. Hit them first, and hit them hard enough to finish them. I kind of get it, but... Of course, I'm not saying that's how you should behave. But thinking about this will make a big difference in a real fight. Yeah, okay, I get it, but... Seriously, Date, are you like acting or something? <laughs> not Date, Master. We are acting. Okay, kill the heart. Like, when you get into a fight, aim for the heart? No, it's the opposite. You must kill your own heart, Mizuki. Oh. What do you mean? That's not what I If expected. you are going to fight, you must suppress any mercy or emotional attachment. If you have even a mote of sympathy within you, it will be impossible to fight to your potential. Do not think of your opponent as a man. Think of them as a target. A punching bag or a board. Just a punching bag. Huh. Anyway, practice these four truths and you will get stronger. This sounds like a scam. Believe yes, it in does. me. If you do as I say, you'll be thanking me in time. Are you sure? But how about we do a baseline test? Show me what you've got. Huh? How? Kick his ass. Uh, let's see. How about you throw a punch? I can guess your strength from that. If you say so, I'll give Drop it a shot. Him. First, close your eyes and concentrate. Like this? Come on, baby. Exactly. Then, 
Punch forward. Straight to the balls. Huh? <laughs> That's a hell of a punch. How is that? Um. She's a You Satan. don't have to be nice. I know I'm weak. Hey, by the way, did you swing back at those bullies? Oh, God, no, those poor kids. No, I didn't kids. do anything. There were a bunch of them. I didn't think I could. I see. She doesn't know her own strength. I suppose not. Mizuki, let's just say I think you should be more confident in yourself. Really? But never ever strike your master. <laughs> that is a must. He just does not want to be hit by that. Yeah, you're right. In fact, you're so strong you scare me sometimes. Well then? No, I can't take you with me. Why not? Because I took responsibility for you. I promised Renju. I can't put you in danger. That's not fair. Bringing up daddy. Iris and Ota feel the same way. They don't want you hurt either. You have to understand, Mizuki. If I need your help, I'll let you know when the time comes. Really? Yes. Promise? I promise. Let's go, Iva. Where to? Okay, where shall we go? Onwards to the cold storage that's going to have nothing for us. At the very least, there is there aren't more dead two people cars. Oh, that's different. These cars have been parked here since before three seventeen a.m. One van and one station wagon. So we're not inside this time. Barrier, weird barrier. Water, city. Hey, hey, Mr. Policeman, what you thinking? Yep, of course, you've got nothing. Okay, cold storage. Nothing useful. Who owns the van? van? The Matsushita family. It appears as though it was used for transporting ingredients and supplies. Tessa, wait! Uh, I'll get the car! Ota's fingerprints were found on the steering wheel and gear shift. Iris's fingerprints were found around the passenger seat. Those were the only prints recently made. Anything else on the anything else found inside the car? There was one thing. Ooh, what you got? What was it? Paprika? Ota's cell phone. Ooh, The that's one he useful. purchased two days ago in Akihabara. Maybe it we can figure out... Driver's seat. How the Where's hell the he now? got the money? Its data is being inspected and evaluated. Damn. I was hoping that we'd get information out of that. Okay, well then, whose station wagon is this? This station wagon is a stolen car. Obviously. Stolen? Last night, the owner of the vehicle reported it stolen. It was stolen at 10.33 p.m. yesterday. The theft occurred in Fuchu, Tokyo, in the parking lot of Famisto, a convenience store along Koshu Highway. The Famisto parking lot, huh? The car was stolen while the owner was shopping inside the store. The vehicle's engine was on. This is why you never fucking do that. The doors might have that. even been unlocked, which would have made the theft easy for the culprit. Who took Anything? the car? Ota Matsushita. What? Have they both Ota get here, Ben? Ota got into the car and drove off. 
The security cameras at the convenience store caught the entire incident. Wait a second. Ota's fingerprints were also found on the steering wheel of that car. So, did he drive the car here, set something up, and then walk back or something and then drive the van here with her? I'm beginning to suspect that he had something to do with this again, even there though he no died in the last game. Ota. The stream of the polar bear started around 3 a.m. Correct. About 10 minutes later, Ota appeared on screen. Ota stole the car at 10.33 p.m. That makes four and a half hours until he appeared on screen. Plenty of time to set up this bullshit. I cannot find anything in the vicinity that could be a clue. Me either. Let's check inside the warehouse. I see a couple of possibilities, but none of them are exactly wow, good. it's cold in here. The air conditioners have stopped. However, the insulation in the walls has kept the room temperature close to what it was this morning. Impressive. I should finish this investigation before I freeze to death. Well then, you had better get started. Hey, hey, Mr. Policeman, you got nothing, don't you? Aren't you cold? Yeah, some engineer from NRIPS created a jacket lined with heating wires. That I love it. Warm. Nice, right? I would All love to have a heating jacket. Okay, ain't progress. I checked this place point by point, but didn't find nothing. Yep, yeah, same as last time, you suck. Hey, investigator. Do you have a family? Because no, unless you find clues... Oh, never mind, can't this, threaten I don't you. Really get the chance to meet new people. Once this case is wrapped up, how about you and I go to a cabaret club together? Dante, hey, do you swing both you're ways? Talking. You're buying, right? No. Sure, I'll expense it. I recorded that conversation. I will be sending it to the boss. Uh, on second thought, uh, why don't we split it? Aw, lame. Yeah. We'll see each other at blah. We seriously auto covers it up. Yeah, wish it were under better circumstances. Too bad you're not a girl. This could be the start of something. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thinking the same thing. Or you could just both be by. That'd work. Any clues? Uh, no, nothing so far. Yeah, okay. Oh, just blood? Yep. A I'd video stream camera and laptop. This is what the criminal used to stream. All of these items have been bought from pawn shops and thrift stores. I have logged into the Wi-Fi in this warehouse. Okiura Fishery Co. Ltd. is listed as the owner. However, I found the password written directly on the router. Anyone who saw it could have used it. Okay, nothing useful. All the, the tires forklifts of the are forklift broken. Are clearly frozen to the ground. It hasn't been moved in a long time. Hmm. What are you thinking? Nothing. It just seemed noteworthy. Interesting. That's different than last time. Okay, so that forklift works this time. That is actually really different. I this cardboard box wasn't here last time. I'm guessing that the costume was kept inside that cardboard box. And that's what he didn't have time to there clean are only up. Only a few items on the shelf. Is this warehouse not in use? Oh yeah, the overhead crane. Hmm. Oh, there's a dark spot. Shadow on the left. Oh, I see something. Shadow. 
let's see, left. Square? It's a wallet. Huh, there's something there. You should go pick it. Huh. I recognize this. An Odoroki made oh. of chocolate. You've been collecting them for three years. Each chocolate contains a special sticker inside. Years ago, you started buying them for Mizuki, but eventually, you got hooked on them. Even after Mizuki lost interest, you kept buying them. That's a bittersweet memory. The Odoroki Man chocolate. Why is this here? Perhaps we can use it as a clue. Let's Let investigate further. Investigate further, you say? Shadow? Look. Really? Can I go and pick it up? Oh, did I already pick it up? I guess I did. Hmm. Question is, why wasn't it there last time? Uh, shelves, his blood, forklifts, that. Let's see, we're finished. 3 a.m. this morning. Iris was lying right here. Yes, she if was. If Ota hadn't come to save her, it would have been too late. Yes, it would have been. Or, he was the one that set all this up, the same as his Twitter thing. I'm still going with that. That machine is used to cut ice. We have gathered testimony from the workers regarding it. This has always been in the warehouse. So the suspect did not bring it here. Any fingerprints? Nothing. No Shouldn't fingerprints have been found at the fingerprints? scene at all. This entire warehouse is clean. That's I fucking see. weird. That's not right. <sighs> oh, it's freezing. Date, we're at our limit. We've examined everything of interest here. Let's go elsewhere. I agree. Let's see. Let's go and see So before he gets chopped up and shoved into a little vase. How did you get in? Hopped over the fence. That's trespassing, you know. My baseball landed in your backyard. I was just trying to get it back. <laughs> Dude. You're actually kind of cute. <laughs> so... What's your boss's relationship with the Kamakuras? You should be silent. I don't know anything. Even if I did, I couldn't tell you. I'm sworn to confidentiality. Yeah. Impressive. Do you know Iris? I don't know. <laughs> no? It's this girl. Cute. What was that? Mm. Uh, nothing. You just said cute, didn't you? I did not. You did. Did not. Did. I said shoot. Why would you say shoot? Look, I said I don't know her, alright? So is Alibi. Congressman Sejima was at home all Friday and Saturday. How about from last night until this morning? He was in his bedroom, resting. Can you prove that? My word should be enough. Iba, are there any security cameras in the mansion? There are several. But for some reason, they are all powered off. There is no image data for the past few days. Really? That's too suspicious to ignore. Well, that's interesting. Shino actually quit streaming. 
Maybe she's going to relaunch on a different game. Let's see. I'm just keeping track of that because I'm getting tired and hungry. Look, Iba, a giant salamander. Ooh, salamander. Mr. Sejima is a wealthy man. Perhaps it is. Really? Let's see. Lantern? Mm -hmm. Well, that is strange. What's strange about a lantern? Why is Reika from the Cabaret Club over there? That's a lantern. It doesn't look anything like her. Oh, I really hope that she didn't dox herself. Oh yeah, and Shackleford, thank you for the follow before. Okay. Stone? And eh, nothing. Can I go inside of your mansion? Nope. Nothing at all is interesting except for you, so... Let's see, do you know Iris? I don't. Who is that? Try a different name. This girl. Do you recall seeing her? Pink's no, not the I've natural hair color. Her. Try the natural. I detect no noticeable rise in So's body temperature. This guy's a politician. Lying is his job. True enough. Well, true. This game is a lot. It deals with death a lot. Yesterday, whenever I was playing it, I watched two kids get sawn in half. So yeah, it's... Pretty bad sometimes. So where were you at 3 a.m. this morning? Here, sleeping, of course. Why? What happened? Did you not see the news? No, I've been reading a book. I don't know what happened, but whatever it was, I had nothing to do with it. Oh yeah, and this guy got chopped up and put in a vase. Okay, about your connection with the Kamakuras. I told you yesterday. My relationship with them is perfectly legitimate. Hey, Iba. You were still in the middle of the story about So selling and buying the Kawasaki land. Oh, we can continue that later. Are Damn. you finished here? I'm just getting started. You won't get anything, no matter what you ask. So Sejima has nothing to do with your case. It's my job to decide that, not yours. <sighs> okay. I didn't want to get rough. But if I need to, I'll feed you to the koi. I'd like Ooh. to see you try. Dante, I'd like to see him try too. Talk. What? Check his body. Dude, how much fucking muscle mass you got? Oh, doesn't matter about muscle. You're carrying gun. Honestly, in America, that wouldn't be a big thing, but in Japan, I get the feeling that that is a big thing. This guy has a handgun. It is, of course, real and loaded. So you're carrying, huh? What are you talking about? Don't act dumb. I should have you arrested for firearm violation. I don't know what you're talking about. The gun you have on you. I don't have a gun. I know that you do. You got a way to prove it? I could search you. Oh yeah? How? You need a warrant for that. <sighs> are you finished? If you are done here, I'd like to ask you to leave. Date, I don't believe we can accomplish anything further here. It's better for us to return to HQ. This is why I hate politicians. Honestly, in this scenario, Dante is the asshole. Okay, so let's go to the diner and hope that she doesn't hate me again like last time. Granted, this time I saved her child from being sawn in half, so, uh, maybe she won't hate me as much? Fingers crossed.
She also watched her child knock me the fuck out. No, she's not crying. Um, uh, who might you be? What? It's me, Konami Date. We met yesterday. We met before I gave you my yesterday. Card. Oh. So, how can I help you? You watched your son knock me the fuck out with the frying pan. Specifically, I believe it was that frying pan. But okay, let's play this game. What is that photo? Oh, this? This is a family photo from when Ota was still small. I wanted to look at it again. What the fuck is that dad's Poor face? Mother. I've always caused trouble for my husband and Ota. They've helped me so many times. I am such a burden. Oh, he's but looking down? They were always smiling. They were so kind. I remember a gift they gave me one Mother's Day. I'm they just creeped out by I this dude's face. Patterns. So they gave me this apron and a kitchen knife. Oh, I was so happy. I was crying and smiling and that's what this photo is from. Oh. It's kind of embarrassing, but isn't it such a nice photo? Yes, that's very nice, Mayumi. Okay, Miyumi. Where's your husband, and why have I never seen him, and why is he so fucked up in that photo? Oh, who knows? Date, I did some research on her husband, Ota's father. His name is Matsushita Takaro. What the fuck is that face? He died of myocardial infarction five years ago. Oh, so she's what? been lying the entire time. What is going on here? That's weird, because she said that he was out on the, to the store or other things. That's, uh, hmm. So I found some chocolate bars. Just to be sure, I decided to ask Mayumi about Okido, about the chocolate, and I took it out of my pocket and showed her. Do you know anything about this chocolate? Odoroki man? Yes, actually. I was hooked on them at one point. My Ota loves them too. When he was younger, he used to collect all the stickers. He was the best at it. Okay. Actually, why was she packing? About last night, your kid knocked me last out. Last night? What time? Before 10 p.m. Oh. I was already asleep by ten. You were sleeping? What the fuck that is up with their memory? Can't be. Or is she just lying to me? Ota. Sleepwalking? You left the diner to chase after Ota and Iris. I saw the whole thing with my own left eye. Left eye? Not both your eyes? Uh, well... Anyway, I don't know what you're talking about. I didn't go anywhere last night. I was asleep. I was dreaming. Dreaming? Yes. A very nostalgic dream. This is all really fucking weird. What kind of dream were you having? It was when my son had just started elementary school. I had Oda run an errand for me. And he was taking so long, and I was waiting. My husband said it was nothing to worry about, but I couldn't take it anymore and went to look for him. I found him at a traffic signal, crying. He said he couldn't come home because the signal was still red. He never pressed the button. But it was one of those crossing signals you have to push. <laughs> that boy didn't even notice it. He just stood in front of that red light. So stubborn. So stupidly honest. Ah, that's my Oda. He was so cute. I couldn't help it. 
Are you done packing up his stuff so that you can go and visit your son? Packing? What are you talking about? Did did she just I have thought a you came here to pack some of Ota's break? things for his hospital stay? Ota? At the hospital? My boy's fine. What the fuck? You shouldn't say things like that to a mother. How fucking Dante, broken is she? I noticed she? something. Can you look at Mayumi with the thermal imaging turned on? Sure. What we got? I'm guessing she's not lying. This tells me nothing. Do you see it? Part of her brain is blue. Oh. That might be due to low blood flow in that part of the brain. She has a stroke? Mayumi has an illness. I have checked her hospital records. For the past six years, Mayumi has been suffering from dementia. Oh. Dementia. Symptoms vary six considerably, years. but Mayumi appears to be afflicted by memory loss. She seems to be missing memories. I see. So that's where those weird comments are coming from. Well, shit. Can she run a diner like that? It isn't running. What do you mean? Matsushita Diner has been closed for eight years. Well, damn. Matsushita Diner is near the Kapasaki District. It is not technically within the restricted area. However, after the chemical plant explosion, the number of potential customers must have dropped considerably. Before the accident, this diner managed quite well due to its proximity to Bloom Park. Patrons from Bloom Park would often eat here, being the cheaper option. But Bloom Park closed eight years ago. The customers stopped coming, and then, naturally... I wonder if her dementia is linked to the chemical plant explosion. The stores closed? I do not think so. Because of the dementia? Yes. I can't believe it. That's... terrible. Dementia is well, a is terrifying thing. I have to start preparing for the dinner shift. Uh, so she didn't. Dante, she doesn't know that let's go. her husband's dead. It's better that you leave things be. She doesn't know that her You're son right. got stabbed. That's. Let's go to the hospital. I wonder, her son has to know. Are you okay? Date. The nurse told me you were here. Yes, just resting. Iris's surgery was successful. They told me she would be fine. After I heard that, a weight left my shoulders and I... It seems that she passed out and was brought here. Yeah, the nurse told me. But I'm fine now. I feel much better. I don't like how calm she is. She was calm whenever her daughter was dead. About your alibi, where the fuck were you? What were you doing around 3 a.m. today? Sleeping. I don't mean anything by it. I'm just doing my job. I was sleeping at home. The police came and picked me up around 4 a.m. That's when I heard about... all this. Her testimony matches what was in the investigation material. The cops came to pick her up around 4? Correct. How long does it take to get from Hitomi's house to the warehouse? 20 to 25 minutes by car. And the polar bear ran out of the warehouse at around 3.15? Correct. If you're fast, you can just make it. Yeah. Do you suspect to tell me? Not necessarily, but... Do you know anything about Iris and So? So Sejima? The politician? Yes. We believe they might know each other. I don't think so. Hmm. About Ota. I am so thankful for Ota. 
No. Words don't even do it justice. Ota saved Iris, didn't he? Maybe. I heard the police talking about it. If Oda didn't go to the warehouse that night, Iris would be dead. Oh, yeah. The only person that knows I the really truth is me and the person with dementia. I don't even know what to say. It's frustrating that there isn't a bigger word for thank you. Uh, Oda was the one that put her in danger in the first place. Oda was actually one of my students. I was his teacher in elementary school. Even back then, he had such a strong sense of justice. Not that I'm one to say, but I believe he grew up to be quite an amazing young man. He risked his own life to save someone else. <sighs> his mother must have raised him well. Yeah, maybe. How about Iris? She... Iris lost her left eye. Yeah, it's not that bad. I lost my... They haven't found it yet. Left one too, I think? If the optic nerve and blood vessels are intact, they told me they might be able to restore it. Yeah, no. <sighs> but I'm thankful she's alive. When I was young, I... I lost someone very important to me. Monica Ui, my best friend. One of the only friends I had. While I was waiting for news from Iris's surgery, I... I started thinking about Monica. Was she an original I felt victim? like I was going to lose my mind. That must have been very painful. Yes. Goodbye. Sorry for asking you so many questions at a time like this. No, it's fine. I should go. Uh. Let's go back to Abyss. Damn. Before we reach HQ, let's summarize our investigation so far. Sure. What she got, Iva? How about so? There is only circumstantial evidence linking So Sejima to the new Cyclops serial killings. It's barely circumstantial. There has to be more to it. The Kumakuras had connections to both victims. So has a connection to the Kumakuras. There's a common link there. They have to be involved somehow. Do they? So Do also they really? have connections to Iris. Because so appeared in Iris's Somnium? Yeah. Tell me more I'm about more so. I'm interested in the hired guns that so uses as bodyguards. I did some research and discovered that Mr. Sejima hires substantial security. If all of his security staff are this heavily armed, Yakuza gangs pale in comparison. Is one gun considered heavily armed? So trying to start trouble? Unknown, but there is definitely more than he is letting on. Weird. I'm exhausted. Likely because you haven't had a good night's sleep. Yeah, it's been a while since I've been this busy. If my body were made of flesh, I would offer my lap as a pillow. Aw, but I'm driving. What? You can't say something like that out of the blue. God, now it's weird. How about Mayumi? Mayumi is suffering from dementia. If Mayumi followed Ota and Iris, it is highly likely that she saw the person in the polar bear costume. That doesn't but... remember anything. She might not remember. Correct. I wonder what happens if I dive into the somnium of somebody suffering from dementia. Mizuki did not have any new information about Okiura Fishery. Currently, it seems there is nothing linking that company to Renju. Hmm. Still, something's not right. Anything else? There is an important piece of news. Oh, what, what you is got? it? 
The Odoroki Man chocolate found at the warehouse. Fingerprints were found on it. Whose? Mayumi Matsushita's. What? Mayumi bought the chocolate at the convenience store 812 on Koshu. This was captured on security footage. Interesting. 812 stores are commonly called eights. Eight is not far from the Famisto where Ota stole the station wagon. And it's Hold really on a odd. I'm having trouble keeping the facts straight. Allow me to summarize. Please. The chocolate was purchased yesterday at 10.33 p.m. That's the same time Ota stole that car. Correct. What conclusions can we draw from that? That they were on a joyride? All that is known for certain is that Mayumi bought the chocolate at an 8 store last night. And that same chocolate somehow ended up in the warehouse. Did she go there and drop it? It is possible. Well... Sorry to interrupt your brainstorming, but there's a call from the boss. Connect hey, boss, who died? Date, did you hear that Iris's operation is over? No, yeah, I did not. I heard about it at the hospital. She made it, right? Yes, but she's still unconscious. She's currently in the ICU. No visitors allowed. All right. Ota, however, seems like he can talk now. Ooh. He's out of treatment? Yeah, he's in a general ward now. Got it. I'll head over. I'll meet you there. Looks like we're going to be getting information out of Ota. How are you feeling, Ota? You know, surprisingly, I'm feeling pretty good. I'm still under anesthesia, so I don't have any pain. All right, that's good. Ota, I'm sorry to put this on you right after your surgery, but can you talk to us for a minute? Yeah, sure. Ota's seeming real different. But I'm gonna be entirely honest, I'm very tired and hungry, so I'm gonna leave it on the cliffhanger again. Sorry. Let's save it. File 4. Yes. Okay. And let's raid. I think I did that right. Boom. Cool, it is going. I hope that you have a wonderful day. Okay. There's that. And... Bye Shackleford and bye Graves. Right now. <laughs>